Welcome to the Adidas Archive. Um, we're a team look overlooking the Adidas collection, uh, covering documents, media, catalogs and adverts, loads of products. We've got about 10,000 shoes, about 9,000 pieces of apparel. This basically uh, is there to give access to any of our colleagues and anyone who wants to be inspired by the Adidas heritage and history. the Micropacer right now from, from 1984. One of the great running icons right. of our heritage. One of the first running shoes with a computer on it. A little socket as well that you could put your keys in. Pretty cool, right? That's pretty sick. The color is amazing. Also the sole, I think, was geared at, at actually the runner at that time. Right. Giving you more grip, more protection. There was even some cushioning up there as well, already yeah. behind it as well. And I think the color of the upper is just amazing. But I actually didn't know that some prototypes had that cable to the computer. And I thought I know everything about the Micropacer, but I didn't. It's apparently. great that it's one of the first shoes with a computer in it, where that was able to actually track your, your race. Yeah, it's just pretty sick. amazing. 1984, one of the first things to go digital. I think also the colorway. The colorway is like so iconic. Yeah, it's really, really interesting. I love it. And I think it's great that this, this old one now again is part of our heritage and history and it's great to, to translate that to, to today. Here's a Boston Super. Again, I'm so impressed by the, by the sole, but also the upper is pretty amazing. The colorway is unbelievable. Again, a running shoe from the 1980s, one of our great running icons from the 80s, which also I think is a great, great inspiration. For, for some new products as well. Another icon here, the marathon trainer as well, used for cross running as well. Look at the sole, it's unbelievable. The trefoils actually, those great details that actually helped gave runners grip when they were running on a hill somewhere out there in the woods. I think it's another iconic shoe. This one is actually a version from 1981, Marathon Trainer. Um, cool shoe in our collection. So this is our apparel collection and this is one of my absolute favorites, a shirt from Team Germany from the 1990s World Cup. Um, Germany did do quite well back then in 1990 and this is an iconic shirt as well that's also part of our footballing heritage and history. Look at the great representation of the German national flag. The trefle at that time was a company's logo and this shirt again um, is a great reference and actually helped inspire the 2018 shirt. But next to sports we also got some great other stuff in our collection. So this is uh, the Rocky Balboa tracksuit. We're not just covering sports, we're over in also covering culture. This is an iconic piece which was made for the Rocky Balboa Sylvester Stallone uh, film. You'll see that here, the Italian stallion Rocky Balboa. Great piece of vintage 1980s product as well. Look at this logo, Knockdown USA, bam. This is one of our oldest bags that we have in our collection as well. It's from the 1960s and also shows the nice representation of the three stripes and the logo development of our company. Um, each of these bags here tells stories. This is an original airliner bag from the 1960s. So it's a cool vintage piece which our colleagues from Originals brought back in that same colorway, but also in a light blue version a couple of years ago. I think it's a cool piece of uh, equipment back then, which was used to carry out sports performance. And now I think it also shows quite nicely the link between lifestyle and sport. <laughs> Here's some worn shoes from iconic Norwegian runner Greta Weitz. The Oregon are part of sporting history because those shoes, as you can see, were clearly worn and used. And Greta wore these in the 1984-1983 season and uh, are now part of our company's heritage and history, featuring the web structure of the Oregon back then, but also an iconic piece which helped Greta win more than nine New York City marathons. One of the first Predators, a great footballing boot 
which has also shaped football and culture and heritage. What we also have is links to popular culture, like this shoe here, which was signed by the whole combo of Run DMC. Piece of history, cultural history, and showing the great lines between sports performance and culture.